I'm making the soup. I'm making a chickpea cactus soup. This is also known as Napolis. So what I'm doing is boiling my cactus. I'm just boiling it with some water. And with the same water and cactus, I'm gonna put it in my pot. And I am making a blender soup. I'm using my Vitamix, but you can use any kind of blender to make your soup. You can use lentils, but I'm using chickpeas, fresh chickpeas. This is gonna be a soup. Okay, so I put my spices, I got turmeric, I got spices in here. You can put whatever kind, whatever you use. I also have some black pepper, turmeric. I got a little garlic salt. I got some garlic seasonings in here. Then over here, in a little butter, I'm sauteing my leeks, garlic. It's like leeks, garlic. And then once this is done, then I'm going to blend it in the blender. It's a blender soup with my chickpeas, also known as garbanzo beans. Okay, so there's my chickpeas, my cactus, and my garlic and onion leeks. Got a little butter in here, my seasonings. I want to say it smells so delicious, like serious. So now... We got to, we're going to blend it up. This is an easy soup to make. All right. We'll start off low. purple jar I'm going to store anybody know about canning vegetables canning soup canning gel well anyway you can can your own soups like you buy the soups in the store right and it'll last you longer and you know it's fresher yes you want to store this in the refrigerator but if let's say if you were canning it you it's a different process to can um and you have to do it right because if you don't do it right your soup can spoil it's a way you do it you boil your jars etc and it's a way you got to put this top on this jar but i'm not canning i'm gonna put this in my refrigerator once it cool and this is my soup yes